Alright. Hello wonderful people! Today I'm going to be showing you how to pierce your own septum in a shop. But first, we're going to need to be talking about some shop safety. You're going to need to keep your safety glasses on you at all times. And then, don't forget your flashlights either. Now we're going to get to the actual piercing part. You can try and do this with a nail and a hammer. That's my favorite option. It gives you the cleanest piercing and it's the fastest. Over here you've got the vise. Uh, this I like to use on more difficult clients. You just put their face gently in the between the clamps. You twist it down and then you can do the piercing without any movement. And over here, these are for those of you into body mods. I've used these on a few, cut off a few ears, a couple fingers. You know, whatever you're into, uh, we can do that here in the shop. Now for this particular piercing, I've chosen the nail. But the first thing we need to do is sterilize it so we don't get any infections. What I'm going to be using here is some used antifreeze that I've collected into this container. So you're just going to dip it in that for just a couple seconds and then you're going to need to light it up. just just for a moment. And that is good to go. You will have no infections. I cleaned my hands with a good cleaner and I um, found some good sterile gloves. Now I've got our tool with a good glove on so it's more sterile. Uh, you're going to need to put this up along the septum at least about one or two inches deep, clamp it, and then you're going to need to take your needle and put it right where you want to do the piercing you, closing your eyes does help for this step um, and then you're just going to count to three and you're going to put firm pressure on the Break, baby! Closing your eyes does help for this step, um, and then you're just going to count to three, and you're going to put firm pressure on the... And then look... <laughs> Ew. <laughs> <laughs> 